may all be seated. Welcome, welcome everyone. Robbie and Heather and their parents would like to thank you all for being here today. We appreciate your efforts to come from near and far to be part of this celebration. I'm Luke Seward and it's my honor to be the officiant of today's wedding. Heather's father, father, Brady, is one of my best friends from childhood. I met her mother, Cindy, at the YMCA when I was just 20 years old. I hosted a party back then where Heather's parents started to date, and wow, here we are today, all these years later, celebrating the union of their daughter, Heather, with Robbie. I was talking to Grady and Cindy last night, and Cindy shared her first impression of this couple was that they are just so happy all the time. Robbie and Heather, one of the greatest gifts you can give both sets of your parents is your happiness. Nothing makes them happier than your happiness. This gift of marriage is miraculous, and the ceremony presents us with a wonderful opportunity to celebrate the love shared between these two souls. Most of you have known them for many years. You watched them grow up. You went to school with them. Or you've known them from work. Because you are the ones that have supported them and known them so well, it's only fitting that you are the ones to share this beautiful moment with them here today. At this time, I would like to invite the nephew of the groom, Prithvi, to share a reading. Good evening, everyone. My name is Prithvi Rathmakar. I'm ready to I guess Robbie's my uncle. <laughs> <laughs> so, I've got a reading here by Ravindranath Tagore. Let your love play upon my voice and rest on my silence. Let it pass through my heart into all my movements. Let your love, like stars, shine in the darkness of my sleep and dawn in my awakening. Let it burn in the flames of my desires and flow in all the currents of my own life. Let me carry your love in my life as harp does its music and give it back to you at last with my life. each other. Join hands as you exchange your vows. Shri Ham, we have to bring this. Do you, Ravi, take Heather to be your spouse? best friend and confidant, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to cherish and to love in this life and all others. I do. Do you, Heather, take Robbie to be your spouse, best friend and confidant, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish in this life and all others. <laughs> and in front of all of us gathered here today to support this couple, it is my great joy to pronounce Ravi and Heather, husband and wife, you may seal this union with a gift.
Don't Don't
we also just want to thank our parents um, really quickly, uh, mom and dad, Grady, Cindy. Uh, thank you guys so much for, for this amazing, amazing location, opportunity. I mean, it's just, it's, it's, it's been such an amazing time. So thank you guys so much. Thank you for all of you done. Thank you for having me into your family. And not just having me into your family, but also all of my family into your family. So thank you so much. I'd also like to thank my mom and dad as well for over here. Um, I mean, the person that I am today is honestly, quite frankly, down entirely to them. And so, you know, the fact that, uh, you know, the Kellogg's, Broderick's, Paddock's, everyone can, you know, accept me for who I am, you know, all the kind things you've said about me, well, quite frankly, that's because of my mom and dad. And for all the support that they've shown me throughout my whole life, through you know, coming to this country, to bringing me up here, to literally giving me every single opportunity that I could possibly ask for. Um, you know, none of that could be without them, and the future that we have uh, would not be without them. So thank you guys so much. I'd like to thank also the, the bridesmaids as well, some amazing, like absolutely amazing words. I'm so happy I had the acceptance of everybody, all of Heather's friends, Heather's sister, the whole family. Thank you so much. My groomsmen, even though Julian had some questionable cricket takes, um, but, you know, they were still absolutely amazing. Robert Sharma and Aunt Coley, by the way, total legends. And of course, you know, he didn't even bring up such a thing because he knew exactly what the answer was going to be the first time. So, you know. Just saying. But again, thank you guys so much again. I won't keep you guys so much longer. I know there's an open bar we have to get to and a dance floor that we have to tear up. So thank you guys so much. Enjoy your evening and let's get it.